This is the world's first text to vector AI. We have seen a lot of image generators, but now we have the world's first text to vector generator that actually generates some real vectors. So it doesn't matter how much you zooming in the image, it will never pixelate because this is a real vectorized image. And this is as simple as any image generator where you just have to enter a text prompt and you will get a real vector as an output. And you can easily transform your vectors to any size and you can change each and every color of your vector and you can even regenerate any part of your vector. And beyond that, this is offering so many features. So without wasting any more time, let's dive into the video. So this tool is called Recraft AI and this is their website where they have shared some information and displayed some of the features like resolution doesn't matter because this is SVG means you can scale your images to any size without losing any quality. And you have different formats to download your images and you can fine tune every detail on your image. So they have also shared a video where he selected the head of a raccoon and regenerated the part with hat on his head. And in the gallery section, you can see that people have generated some really good arts like logos, illustrations, stickers and web designs. Now to access this tool, you just have to click this sign up button in the upper right corner and just sign in with your email and you are in. On the left side, just click that drop down arrow and you can see we have different options like vector art illustrations, icons, 3D illustrations, backgrounds, realism. So select one of your model and if you don't see this canvas, you can simply type L from your keyboard or you can click this icon to add a new layer. So let's generate letter M with a golden crown. And it came out with this image and gave us two options to select one. And you can easily transform this image to any size if you want to. So this was a very simple prompt. Let's try something else. So let's try some other models like this cartoon model where I ask you to provide me a vector of a tomato with eyes and just look at the images. And it really looks like a very experienced graphic designer designed this image. And if you don't satisfy with the results, you can always ask it to regenerate your images. So if you want to change the color, you can click this edit button and you can change each and every color of your vector according to your preference. And now I think that the graphic designer should worry about this. So, so if you want to regenerate any part of your vector, you can simply select this repaint option and make a selection of the area that you want to regenerate. And in my case, I asked him to turn his eyes blue and he changed only the eyes keeping rest of the image just as same. And it gave me two options. So you can select one of the option that you likes most. It also works very well with icon. So if you want to generate icons, select that icons model and pick one of the style that you like. Let's say uh, I want to make an icon of a scooter. Uh, so it will give me four different options to select. And remember, if you don't like pre-designed color scheme, you can always change that manually. So if you want to generate more images on a single page, you can create an other layer by pressing L on your keyboard and generate whatever you want, like icon of a pizza, like car, and the options are endless. So if you want to upload your own style, you can click this upload button and you will have some pre-designed styles and you can pick one of these designs and if you don't like these designs, you can upload your own design. And if you want to keep the colors consistent in every generation, you can add your own colors to the color pilot section. Or you can click this more button and it will automatically suggest you some colors. Now, whatever color you pick, it will make every vector only around those colors. So the process is simple. Just set your colors for the one time and keep on generating without doing any manual work. And this is just at its initial stage. Just think that after a few months or a year, where this tool will be. So if we talk about illustrations, it also works very well in that field. Just select the illustrations model and simply enter your prompts. Like in this picture, just look at the details, how crisp this image is and how sharp the edges are. So if you want to remove its background, you can press remove background and in few seconds, your background is removed. And if you want to convert this into a vector, just click this vectorize button and after some kind of processing, it's done. Now it is converted into a vector. So you can do a lot of things with this tool and I will highly recommend you to use this tool and believe me guys, you're gonna love it. So right now this is completely free to use and I don't know how long it will be free because this is a really, really powerful tool. So that's it from this video. And if you want to stay updated with the AI tools like this, make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.